Hi hey everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to get voluminous waves using the Remington TI Studio Silk Ceramic Heated Clip Setters. These are really easy to use and I like that you can leave them in your hair while you're getting ready for work or a night out. I like to put these in my hair before I get dressed and before I put on my makeup. So I'm just going to start by brushing all of the knots out of my hair and then sectioning off my top layers of hair so just my very bottom layers get put into the setters first. So I just start by taking the clip off of the roller and uh, it's fine to touch, they're not too warm and I just like to start at the bottom of my hair and then in an un under motion I just like to roll the curl up my strand of hair and then I just set it with the clip and it stays pretty firm, you know, you don't have to worry about them falling out. So I'm just going to do this on the rest of my head of hair, I like to take strands of hair that are about, I guess I'd say one to one and a half inch thick and I always like to roll the curl, the curler under. And there are two sizes of rollers in the box, so I like to use the larger rollers on my bottom layers of hair and then save the smaller ones for my top layers of hair, which you'll see. So when I reach my very top layer of hair, I just like to make sure that I'm parting my hair where I want my hair to be parted and I'm putting in the rollers with my part already there um, because your hair will just look a little messed up if you're not actually rolling in the curlers in with your natural part. So I'm just going to start putting in these smaller rollers at this time and I don't like to leave these in for as long um, just because you don't want your curls as tight right near the top of your head. So that's why I always do these ones last. So since I have a lot of hair, I actually end up having to take out the bottom setters from my bottom layers of hair and then re-put those back into the heater and then I finish doing my very top layers of hair just because I just have so much hair that 20 of them isn't enough for me. So once those curlers are reheated, I'm just going to finish with that very top layer of my hair. So while my rollers are setting, I just like to go and do my makeup and anything else I need to do before I head out. And during this time, it just lets the rollers cool down and then I get these great waves and curls. So the rollers are super simple to take out. All you have to do is undo the clip and just roll them down. So once my curlers are out, I just like to style my hair by just running my fingers through it. You can put in a little bit of hairspray. I don't really need to do that though since my hair holds curls super well because my hair is naturally curly. But there you can see I just got these great, nice, natural looking waves. And on top of that, my roots are really volumized, which is one thing I really like about using these, these rollers. Mm -hmm. 